day and a spectacular uh, event. Great timing on that kayak event for a day like this. Wonderful timing. Yeah, falling here on the weekend. The river temperatures in the mid 50s, but outside we had temperatures warming up to the 70s today. And it's some of that heating that we have going on outside right now has which has led and aided to some of those thunderstorms across the Cascades, which we'll talk to and talk more about here in just one second. Here's the view coming out of Portland. Nice blue sky. We like that. It's a great view, as Wayne mentioned. It's a great weekend. Good timing for us. We have Kalama right there, a couple clouds out there. McMinnville, maybe a thunderstorm trying to develop over the coast range. And Lincoln City, a couple gray clouds. But overall, it's been a dry day for the Oregon coast. Here's the view coming out of Portland as we look across the Willamette River over towards the west. Temperatures at 73 degrees. The northwest breeze is pushing about 10, maybe 15 miles per hour. That's about it. It's not too strong out there today, but I do expect it to maybe increase heading into Monday. 70s up and down the Willamette Valley. Some 50s out for the Oregon coast. A little bit cooler there for Mount Hood. Yeah, higher in elevation there. We have 63 degrees for Madras and 62 for Dallas, but from the mountain down to the valley, as you could tell, there's about a 30 degree difference there. All right, 24 hour temp change. We're a good 10 to maybe even 15 degrees warmer here today at this time than yesterday. Now I'll show you what's going on out there. We're seeing a couple of these showers and some of these cells blooming up into thunderstorm is producing some lightning, maybe even some small hail. We still have some colder air aloft. That was pretty uh, transparent there with the temperature that we had at Mount Hood. So with that and the heat, and what we have going on aloft, it's initiated some of these showers. And here through the coast range, again, the elevation helps getting that going as well. We call that lift. All right, here in the valley, though, we are pretty dry outside of maybe just a couple cells there to the west of us and through the Cascade foothills and over the Cascade crest. And then we get over towards central Oregon, the Dalles, Dufer area, uh, area, Grass Valley. Notice a couple showers there. Again, at times, they may produce some lightning. So. If you see kind of that ominous cloud coming in your direction, just head inside for maybe a good 15 minutes there. For tomorrow, another nice day. I have temperatures warming back into the 70s. A lot of sunshine there starting in the morning and maybe a few more clouds in the afternoon, especially the late afternoon into the evening. May get some high thin clouds aloft starting to fill the gap too. So that's something we'll keep an eye on, but I don't think we'll see too much as far as rain goes for tomorrow. That was more so for today, but we'll keep an eye on that. Pretty dry over the next couple of days when the driest stretches that we've had so far this spring. We will bring the rain back on Thursday again on Friday, and then we'll have to see about the following weekend into early next week. If we have much of anything right now, this seems like it would just be a couple isolated showers. Future cast early tomorrow morning, as I mentioned, should be dry. Yeah, hey, watch what happens as we go through the day, though. A few more clouds. This is uh, the evening hours there. There's about 8 p.m. So, again, high thin clouds to begin, maybe thicker as we get into the overnight hours. A little weak disturbance tries to pass on through. We should stay dry. That goes for Monday as well and heading into Tuesday. I think the first part of the work week is going to be right around average. Some clouds in and out, but we will probably stay dry. Until we get to Thursday, I think by Thursday and heading into Friday, we start seeing a little more moisture, another disturbance, and that's going to lead to some rain. As far as temperatures go, 74 degrees on Sunday. All right, 69 there on Monday with the light breeze. Not bad, 71 on Tuesday. Gets warmer, warmer there. By the time we get to Wednesday, Wayne, we're at 75 before we cool right back down heading into the weekend. Nice looking week there. All right, thank you, Joseph. Next, COVID-19.